Hi, Dr. Megan. Oh, hi, Fleech. What are you doing? Well, I'm working on a new puppet. Wow, the beginnings of life as I know it. You know, it's interesting how puppets all start out the same but end up looking so different. That's an insightful thought, Fleech. Have you been drinking the insidifying solution again? The what? Uh, here, uh, watch this educational video. It'll explain it. Watch what? Uh, right, right up there, educational. Hello, and welcome to the Institute for Ridiculous Science. I'm Dr. Jeff, director of the Puppetorium. Today we're going to discover why each of our creations is both unique and scientifically funny. Our dedicated researchers have scientifically identified over 27 hilarious attributes that uniquely impact the ridiculousness of the finished puppet project. This team of highly trained specialists carefully select the individual attributes for each experiment. This allows us to identify each puppet's unique sequence of PNA, or puponucleic acid. Yes, PNA, the building block for all puppet life. Without PNA, no puppet could exist. After we've determined the attributes for each puppet, we carefully add the fomosomes to the PNA sequence. There, that should do it. Now we take some time to let the PNA stew. Our team of ridiculous scientists have developed several secret and frankly disturbing processes for the activation of the PNA molecules. Ah ah ah, we can't show you all our secrets. But after several grueling beers, the final puppet project is born. And that's the secret of PNA. Thank you for watching. That didn't make any sense at all. Oh, Fleege, that's because we made you a little dumb. Oh. Oh! What am I supposed to do with this?